Hey y'all, it's your girl. It is Sister Talk with Valerie, your chocolate smoothie. Coming at you today with another episode of Sister Talk with Valerie. Now, I am waiting for my guest, Miss Joyce Foster. And I want to say beforehand that your discretion is advised. Because today we're going to be talking about a really serious subject for young ladies. right? So men, brothers, if y'all don't want to be a part of this, conversation, you know, y'all could jump off right now. But if you have daughters, it might be an interesting conversation for you. Because Ms. Joyce Foster is the CEO of Rain Products. And what it is, is she's a jewel awareness ambassador. And she makes comfy, dry, sanitary napkins for women. It's a really interesting subject. Um, if you want to hear more about Joyce, you can go to JoyceForster.Jewel, J-E-W-E-L-S, pads.com. It's really cool. It's like it's called rain pads. They contain this graphene material that helps to relieve painful abdominal cramps. They help balance the body's pH. They help eliminate harmful bacteria. They help with aroma, they help fight fatigue, they help boost metabolism, boost immune system. The graphene seems to move the heat away from your core and contains uh, vibrational energy. I didn't know anything about that, but I'm, I think it's a great, wonderful product. And I really hope that Miss Joyce Foster hops on so she could tell us more about it. I'm just going to send her a quick message to let her know that we are live and waiting for her and waiting. In the meantime, y'all, what is new? What is going on? What is happening in your world? Hey, Maisha, good evening. How are you, Maisha? So we were supposed to have a special guest today. Her name is Miss Joyce Foster. Hopefully she'll be on before our hour is over. But she was going to talk about her product. So I have given a disclosure at the beginning of this um, Sister Talk Live that viewer discretion is advised. Because, you know, some people don't want to talk about women's feminine problems, but they're real. Um, I know that my daughter, Kia, she used to have terrible, terrible cramps, like terrible cramps, where she would feel so sick and she would vomit and go through all of these changes. And so she was just out of commission and her cramps didn't stop until after she had her first child. In doing some research on Joyce's product, I find out that there are some um, materials that are in sanitary napkins that are harmful to women. And what we know is that there's a lot of things that's harmful that we need to be aware of. But that was one of the things that I wasn't aware of about how there are these chemicals that when as women we are we have to wear you know sanitary napkins these chemicals can kind of come into our bodies and harm us oh here is our guest miss joyce foster let's bring her on let's bring her on all right there she is we can't hear you joyce but i can see you i can see i can see part of you <laughs> let me see how we can do this so we can see you a little better there you are. There you are, Miss Joyce. How you doing today? Now you might want to check your sound because I can see you look beautiful, but I cannot hear you. I was telling everyone about um, Jewel Sanitary Napkins and www.comfydrypads.com. So I really can't wait to hear more about what really motivated you to start this line and tell us more about these rain, you being a rain ambassador. Sometimes you'll have to um, check your, your camera and mic. That might be why I can't, we can't hear you. Yeah, you're not coming through. Um. It's usually in the computer that you, you have to check your mic and see if your mic is connected. 
Y'all, Miss Joyce is still an entrepreneur and a business owner. That's one of the reasons why I wanted to um have her to have her come on. And she won't be mad because she told me this. Miss Joyce is 73 years old and she's an entrepreneur. So if Miss Joyce could be an entrepreneur, y'all can be an entrepreneur too. Miss Joyce found her calling and she walked in and it, y'all. So there's no excuse. There's no age requirements to be an entrepreneur. Once Miss Joyce gets her mic connected, she's going to tell us more about this. But in the meantime, let me give y'all just a little bit more background on Miss Joyce Foster. She was born in New York City. It seems that since I've been in Virginia, I mean, a lot of people that is from the north, like me, I'm from Jersey. Um, she was she was born in New York in the Upper West of Manhattan between Amsterdam and Broadway. Miss Joyce talks about how she went to a local schools and um, she found out in her first high school that she wanted to be a famous fashion designer. She talks about fast forward that she had a job um, that eventually made her understand that she needed a college degree. She also worked in a office in Houston, Texas, and somehow she had received an email that was asking for some help for suffering girls and women. And that was one of the reasons that got her started really in this, really, people say it's unusual, but like I said before, women know that we have um, some feminine issues that we need to deal with and we don't talk about it a lot. So I'm glad that Miss Joyce took it upon herself to be what she calls um, the Jewel Awareness Ambassador for ComfyDryPads.com. Mm. She says she is passionate about period poverty, y'all. I never heard it put like that before. But one of the things that, as I told you guys early on, is that um, we have begun, in my family, we have begun to have a celebration of all of the young girls that are in our family celebrating coming into their womanhood by having period parties. Because we... I, and I got this from one of my girlfriends, Londilia. And the reason why we celebrate our young ladies and our family with period parties is because it's, it's, it's something that happens for young girls that can often be traumatic. You know, it is when their body is changing and people have it at different times in their life. I started my menstrual when I was nine years old. My granddaughter just started hers and she's nine years old. So it's a traumatic time. So the reason why we wanted to celebrate having period parties because we wanted our girls to feel special. We wanted them to celebrate this time in their life when they was really coming into their womanhood. We wanted to give an opportunity for us to share information, talk about our experience. And they have really embraced it and taken it on. Like my granddaughter, she was so excited for her period party. Her sister was mad because she couldn't have one because she hadn't started her menstrual cycle. So this is something that I think the reason why I think is a good subject matter is because there are certain subject matters that we tend to shy away from, but it's a part of life. You know, it's a part of what brings women into their womenhood. It is how we bring life into this world. So I think it was an important topic. Miss Joyce, let me say, I can't hear you yet, but are you able to to respond to us in the chat? Maybe you can post some comments in the chat and talk to us that way. Let me see if you're on, if I can get you on chat. All right, let's see. All right, y'all. Hold on. Y'all know how technology is. It works when, when it wants to, but not all the time. Pass. Stop comments in the chat and talk to us that way. See, I can hear my big mouth, <laughs> but I can't hear Miss Joyce. I need your chat. All right. All right. Let's see. All right, so I still can't hear you. And it's unfortunate, y'all. Let me tell you something. If Miss Joyce is not able to come on today, we are going to work her technology out so she can come on because I really want y'all to be able to get 
some information. This is good information, right? If you are if you are a woman, period, and we know it's a whole bunch of us in the world. If you have daughters or sisters or aunts or nieces or granddaughters, this is important information that you want to talk to them about. Like, hey, let's talk about the fact that y'all know that if if we talk about how the things we eat can make us sick. We talk about the things that are in the environment that can make us sick. It really blew my mind because I never thought about it that Miss Joyce was talking about how feminine sanitary napkins can have toxins in them that can really make us sick. And you don't think about it because you 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 know you use them for a long time. Me and my sisters were talking about how our mom used to always tell us that she didn't believe in tampons. So all of our life, none of our, none of our sisters, none of the girls wore them because my mom said it was a bad thing. So we didn't wear them until we got adults, right? But my mom worried about back in the day, there was a lot of information that um, tampons gave you, you know, they were toxic. They created toxin in your body. So that's something that we just grew up with and we never did it. So Miss Joyce is talking about, and, and before um, we go, I want to give you just a little bit of information. So you can go to her website. It is Joyce Foster, J-O-Y-C-E-F-O-S-T-E-R dot Jewel, J-E-W-E-L pads dot com. It's a really nice website. Um, it talks about uh, the premium sanitary napkin. And again, it talks about it is infused with this graphene strip that provide these various health benefits. So as I said before, they help relieve painful abdominal cramps. They help balance the body's pH, eliminate harmful bacteria, help with aroma, fatigue. They boost the metabolism. They boost the immune system because this, this graphene chemical moves heat from your core that contains vi vibrational energy. And I, I mean, I'm like, wow. This is interesting stuff here, y'all. If you go to her website, you will find um, what she called, and then she has this really, really cute and dainty um, packaging, right? It's called Rain, Rain Premium Napkins. I mean, it makes you, they got all different colors, got the pink and the gray, and it talks about discovering the value that they provide. They got purple, they got all these cute little, and that's, we like that, ladies, we like that. Then she got the this bad one that's like black and gold. I mean, it's just the, her packaging just really looks good. We know that packaging is nine, 90% of marketing. So the packaging is really, really nice. So it's not something, you know, how we used to hide, you know, hide the box when we went to the store because we ain't want nobody to know we always buy. Well, Miss Joyce, she she stepped up the game so that the pads is, is fabulously looking fabulous and the packaging is looking fabulous. The other thing is that I'm going to give y'all some more information. So it says that the goal at Jewel is to help you look good as you feel, right? Their mission is to develop products and opportunities that give you the power to protect the confidence that radiates from within. So whatever your age, your background, your, your lifestyle, Jewel provides you with products that will improve your life and your lifestyle. They invest in their research and development into creating product, products that not only offer exceptional results, but they're multifunctional, multifunctional, okay? They address many different aspects of your life. So it has an eight layers of protection, y'all. Now that's bad. Now that's bad. <laughs> eight layers of protection. So layer one, and then she has this sort of diamond next to each layer to as she's in her bullet points telling you about, I'm telling you, it's all class. So layer one, rain sanitary napkins has three dimensional layers and leak guard sides for extra protection against leakage. Layer two, the second layer of rain has an ultra soft cotton top layer. It's extremely comfortable and soft to the skin. Then layer three, is an innovative design that offers a Nobel Prize winning material. And that's what I was talking about. It's called the graphene. It's an infused strip. The infused graphene strip 
may provide various health benefits that I've mentioned to potentially help the circulatory health and cell activity and metabolic health. In addition, it may help inhibit harmful bacteria growth. Layer four of RAIN offers an aid laid design for extra protection against undesired leakage. And they have this innovative design and it's in depth at moving the moisture away from the body so that we feel comfortable and we feel dry. Then layer five is designed with a safe, super absorbent polymer or absorbing up to 10 times more menstrual flow than traditional napkins. Now, come on, y'all. You can't beat that. We know what it's like when you, you know what I'm saying, when you low on dollars and you get them little cheapies and it don't work really well. Layer six of the rain design offers reinforcement against moisture. So it has an additional layer of air laid. So the rain sanitary napkins innovative design is inept at moving moisture away from the body, as I said before. And then the seven layer offers extreme breathe ability, which eliminates heat and undesirable moisture. And the micro perforated bottom layer offers air dispersion to keep the area cool and most of all dry. And it helps prevent growth of harmful bacteria because that's where we can get infections and that's where we can get these harmful toxins. And then finally, layer eight of rain is durable, agricultural grade, adhesive, without the use of toxic chemicals. Now, y'all, this ain't nothing but the truth, y'all. I'm telling you, it says many manufacturers use the constructive grade adhesive, which can extremely um, detrimental to the female's most precious area. So other manufacturers use a constructive grade adhesive, whereas rain and rain is connected with being a queen and being beautiful offers something differently. This really, really important ingredient, which I told you before, is called the graphene. How did I do, Miss Joyce? Can you hear me? I hope you can hear me. Oh, I got a thumbs up, y'all. I got a thumbs up. All right. I got two thumbs up. Okay. So, again, I want you guys to go on Mrs. Joyce's website. It is Joyce Forster. That's all one word, dot. Jewel. Check it out. Everything got to do with reigning and queen and being majesty. It's jewelpads.com. And you can see what I'm talking about. You can see the testimonials. There are several testimonials on here, customers who've had positive experiences. There's one that says, I love jewel pads. They stay dry for a long time. They're comfortable and they don't move around. And I wore them doing a 14-hour drive to Florida and it kept me comfortable and dry. Now, you know what? A comfortable 14-hour drive to Florida, that's something if it said they, that she was comfortable. And another, um, she has a lot of nice, a lot of nice um, testimonials. One says, I just gave birth to a, this beautiful baby about a week ago and was so blessed by my aunt with these amazing jewel sanitary napkins. I can honestly say that they have captured all the waste that's been built up in my body without mess or odor. I have no cramps. She has that in bold. I have no cramps. Now, ladies, do you, those, and I'm past the menstrual cycle and I'm in menopause, but I do remember what cramps feel like. For this young lady to say, I had no cramps at all. And it doesn't feel like I have anything on opposed to those hospital pads and other brands that ladies always wear. Another thing about that's brilliant about these pads is that it's made in the U.S. Come on. Who's better to create a product of uh, such a product than women? Now, a product for women by women made in the U.S. And one more, I'm going to give you all one more testimonial. And this is from a happy customer. It says, a friend gave me an example of the pink pack of moderate flow. She only sampled me two of the pads. I was so satisfied with how comfortable and thin that the pad felt that I called her for more information to order myself. I definitely noticed the difference. I felt dry for a change. It didn't irritate me. It didn't irritate from cycle to the store brand. And I'm so comfortable in going out when my cycle is down rather than staying inside during time of the month. I feel I can enjoy life every day instead of 
carving out seven days of my life that I can't just enjoy normal activity. So that is fabulous. I'm also going to tell you um, a little bit about, it says why rain. And again, I've said that it's about the absorbency. It's about the the graphene light bulb energy demo. Um, and, and I told you about all the benefits. So again, Y'all, go to the website and check out Miss Joyce Foster and Jewel Padge. You won't regret it. And what do you have to you lose? Because y'all know that we don't see some, you know, all different type of brands. Hey, Eleanor, I hope you go to Miss Joyce Foster's website, Joyce.Foster. I'm going to give it to everybody again. Joyce Foster, all one word, dot. Jewel, J E W E L pads.com. That's Joyce Forster, all one word, dot jewelpads.com. Eleanor, it's good to see you. Maisha, it's good to see you. We're talking about, we're talking about a subject that impacts women, right? And for real, for real, guys, it impacts y'all too, because when, when we, when we had that time of the month, we're not nice. So maybe if you want to buy somebody a present, your, the woman in your life, you might go out and buy her one of these classy looking packaged um, jewel pads. And that might make her a little bit happier uh, during that time of the month. <laughs> Eleanor says, I'm giving you, Eleanor gave me a thumbs up. So that's our conversation. I'm going to, again, y'all, I am going to have Miss Joyce come back. Once she figures out that technology, because we're having, she's having difficulty um, with her speakers today. So I am going to have Miss Joyce come back so y'all can talk to her. Again, Miss Joyce is 73 years old. She has, she is a, a, a thriving entrepreneur. She, you know, that, and, and, and then she's an example, again, that we can do whatever we want to do. It don't take nothing to be an entrepreneur. And y'all know that one of the things that makes people of color, serious entrepreneurs is that we always, we, we, we have a lot of things that we have invented, but normally our inventions and our becoming entrepreneurs is out of need. So Ms. Joyce said, listen, it's women out here using sanitary napkins and they getting all these chemical toxins and it's, it's, it's infected and impacting their body and their health. So I'm going to find a way to contradict that. I'm going to find a way to help them. So she went the extra layer in finding this wonderful chemical, this wonderful product called graphene that can help women stay healthy during their cycle, their menstrual cycle. And she went the extra mile in making the package look classy, look sleek, and she relates it to everything in Queendom. She calls it rain products, it's jewel, comfy pads. Everything is about making women feel good. And I'm all about making women feel good. Miss Joyce, Eleanor says, hey, to you today. And the other thing that I told y'all, and I'm going to keep saying it, is Miss Joyce is 73 years old, y'all. 73. And I'm always talking about, oh, I'm all 58, feeling like I'm 90. Miss Joyce, 73, and she just pop out, pow, me. So... If Miss Joyce can do it, we can do it, y'all. So I appreciate y'all coming on today to talk to me and Miss Joyce. If you miss any part of this, don't worry, because we will be back. We will be back um, with Miss Joyce. You know, technology is great when it works, but when it don't work, it's it's a something. It's a something when it don't work. So, Miss Joyce, I want to schedule something else with you at a later time so that you can come back and talk to my Sister Talk with Valerie audience and you could rock out with the chocolate smoothie. It's all right, Ms. Joyce. I understand. I go through that all the time because I'm not technically inclined and it'd be pissing me off when I be thinking things get ready to go smoothly and the computer act crazy. So don't worry about it. You can go to my um, Facebook page and you can play this back, Miss Joyce, and you can share it with your friends and your customers and your family, because I will definitely give you a testimonial for your jewel pads and share the information with everybody. I think that when you have a product and a vision to make women feel beautiful and make women feel like queens, and you are conscious of our safety and you're conscious of the environment, then that's something to celebrate. So we celebrate in you. 
All right, y'all. So today was a quick show, but come back. I, I remember Fridays at seven thirty on Untapped Music Radio. You can click on and listen to Untapped Music Radio and Sister Talk with Valerie. Your chocolate smoothie tomorrow night. We are going to be hosting a listening party for one of our friends who just um, dropped his his um what they call it they don't call it i was going to say album they don't call it albums anymore now they call it cds i don't even know what they call it eleanor what do they call when you drop music now do they just call it music because i i want to say i want to say cd i want to say tape i want to say album but i don't think that's what you call it eleanor but whatever you call it mr cvg is dropping his tomorrow. Tomorrow is Stevie G's listening party. Myself and April are going to host his listening party. It's going to be at 7 o'clock. We're going to rock out, listen to music. We're going to have Mr. DJ Get Loose on there as well. So y'all join us tomorrow night at 7 o'clock. And then at 7.30, y'all tune into Untapped Music Radio. And you listen to Sister Talk with Valerie. All right, y'all. That's it for tonight, Miss Joyce. Thank you so much for joining us. Don't worry about it. We will reschedule. You let me know when you're available, and we will be back. We will be back. Eleanor says she thinks it's an album. Girl, Eleanor, you're just as old as I am. I don't think it's a, I don't think it's called an album no more. <laughs> but whatever. It's music. It's music. All right, y'all. Have a good evening. I'm a CD. Yeah. Something like that. It's tomorrow. It's with Stevie G. It's going to be bomb. That's all we care about. Good night. Love you.